peligroso, hay que tenerle cuidado. Sí, sí. Entonces ya por lo menos ahora no, ya no le dieron puntada, gracias a Dios. Uy, menos mal. Sí. ¿Cuántos años tiene su mamá? Eh, 67 tiene. Bueno, qué bendición. Sí. Good evening. Lo que pasa es que no le han... Good evening. Good evening. Hi. Glad to see you again, Marcela. Thank you. Welcome, welcome back. I thank hear you, thank you. your mom is better now. Yes. Nice. Uh, uh, no sé cómo se dice, no tuvo fractura. The word, I mean, she has no anything broken. Right? Uh -huh. Broken. Uh -huh. okay. Yeah, she didn't sí, break no. any, any bone. Uh -huh. sí. Solo mu la muñeca que se lo dobló un poquito y la había súper inflamada. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. pero, pero gracias a Dios, no, sin fractura. But she's not in the mm -hmm. hospital, she's in the house. No, sí, en la casa. Yeah, yeah, because if it's, she's in the hospital, oh, it's difficult. Sí, mm -hmm. mucho. Well, thank God. Okay, good evening, everybody. Uh, Margarita is not joining today because she had an emergency. So we're gonna miss Margarita tonight, okay? Well, good evening, hello, hello. I hope everybody's okay. I hope you're fine. I hope you had a wonderful day, a better day, an interesting day, okay? Good evening. All right. I'm glad to see you. Yes, thank you. Likewise. Mm -hmm. What else? Everybody is invited to write on the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody is able to. Yeah, now you have like these little emojis you can share. Yes, on the chat. That's nice. We're going to give some minutes waiting for the person. Ah, some people have a video on the background. <laughs> Improving. Yes. Nice. Parsley. Yes. Great. All right. Okay, it's, let's get started. Let's share what we are studying tonight. The lesson for tonight. We're going to continue practicing. Yes, definitely. The prepositions, right? And today is Thursday, August the 25th of 2022. And this is our video conference number 18. Imagine 18, two more, and it's over. <laughs> and the next course, the five, the twenty, no, the 5th of September, right? Is Thursday. It is Thursday, yeah. Thursday, Ooh. August 25, 2022. Exactly. In this case, we say 25th. Fifth. Ah, no era yes. solo hasta el, el tres que se decía. En <laughs> ah. the fight. Ah, vaya. Ah, bueno. <laughs> yes, it's first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and then normal. Just the TH. Yes, I forgot to mention the 25th. Yes. Hello, good evening, Isaac. Welcome, welcome. Okay, how do you feel? Look for an emoji. How you feel? How do you feel tonight? <laughs> Say something with an emoji. Show the emotions. Uh huh. Happy. Tired. Exhausted. 
hungry, sleepy, great, excited. Mm -hmm. All right, nice. That's great. I didn't know that they had added this emojis. All right. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. Well, as I was saying, yes, today is Thursday and the topic definitely prepositions of place practice. Okay. So yesterday we start practicing there is, there are. So you can say there is a gas station opposite my house or there is a hospital next to my job, right? So there, then you are using there is, there are and the prepositions of place to name places, right? So that is the idea. All right. So at the end of this session, participants will be able to use prepositions of place practice. All right. And of course, we have to have the attendance. So far, yes, we have some students already, some participants already. So it is about time. Now we are more efficient taking the attendance, I know. That's great. Let me get to the attendance. Cheat. I bet I want to request you, yes, for one second. Mm -hmm. Just need a second because I am uh, starting with a new account. Let me get it. Let me get it. All right. Tonight, no solamente van a decir present, sino que van a decir algo más en inglés. Pueden decir, I feel good, I feel fine, I had a wonderful day, algo más. No solo pueden decir present, tienen que decir present y algo más. Yes? Present, I love Coca-Cola. <laughs> or present, I, I didn't have dinner. Or present. In this moment, I drink the Coca-Cola. Uh, water. That's no yeah. good. Yes, water. <laughs> but uh, okay, <laughs> the idea is that you say something in English. Que no solo digan present, sino que le agreguen algo más. Okay? Ready? Ya vean pensando qué decir. Please. Oh, my favorite food is tacos. I never go to the movies. Oh, my favorite movie is whatever you want to say about yourself, right? Is the idea clear? ¿Te queda claro que es lo que van a hacer? Yes. Clear. All right. Perfect. All right. Vamos a empezar al revés. Sandra. No here. Rodrigo. I hear and I I went to San Miguel in the morning. It's true, you told me you were going to go to San Miguel. What time did you get to San Miguel today? Uh, at 6, at 7. Uh, repeat the question. What time did you arrive to San Miguel? Ah, uh, for 4.30. For 4.30. For 4.30. For for a esa hora salió de acá. Yes. And what time did you arrive to San Miguel? I arrived in San Miguel uh, fifth, uh, seven, seven, forty-five, seven forty-five. Seven forty-five. So, so. Wow, that was a good yeah, time. I, I, <laughs> enough. Yes. Uh, uh, no breakfast. No breakfast. No. No. Far, 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 far. San Miguel is very far. Yes. And what time did you come back? Uh, 12. At 12. 12. Uh, so, quarter. Super fast. So, so, yes. The visit uh, was super fast. Yeah, rip, rip in San Salvador. Uh, 230. 3.50. 3.50. 4 p.m. Wow. That oh, was super late. Yes. Yes. All right. Thank it's you for very, sharing. This topic is very heavy. Too much traffic. Exactly. exactly. I know. All right. Thank you for sharing. That was a very good. You see, you can communicate in English. Raúl. 
Present. Continue. I am preparing the dinner. For your children. Yes. Oh, enjoy. For my kids. Oh, that's so cute. Great. Good job. Good dad. Como se dice, se me quema la comida. <laughs> the food gets burned. <laughs> the food is get burned. <laughs> Be careful. Bye, bye. <laughs> Be careful. Rene. Present means. <laughs> continue. <laughs> uh, very happy to continue learning with this beautiful group. Yes, nice. It's true. This is a wonderful group. Yes. I see. Very responsible. Good job. Se, se, se entiende, teacher. Yes. Oh, Maybe. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> everybody uh, understood and everybody clapped. That's a, a student, repeat. Tal vez así me, me entiende. Yo creo que no. No, Levanten they, la mano los que sí entendieron, sí. No, they understood. They said, yes, oh. awesome. <laughs> oh, nice. very good. Yes, thank you. Okay. Manuel Alberto. Present, miss. Sorry, pero no entendí, no logré captar la idea cuando entré. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't understand the instruction. <laughs> Tiene que contarnos algo, whatever. Aparte de ser present. In English, of course. I, I, I work in so much this day. I, I believe, yes, I work too much today. Or work it was really Yo, hard. Recién llegando, ¿cómo se dice? I just got I, home. I, uh, uh -huh. Or I, I just, just arrived home. Right home. Mm -hmm. yes. yes. All right. But happy to have you here. I'm glad you connected to the class. All right. Nice. Jocelyn. Not here. Oh, goodness. Daniel. Present. Yes. I always make early every day. Nice. You get up early every day. True. True, true, true. A five, 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Yes, that's early. Definitely. <laughs> yes, yeah, sometimes I have to get up at 5, 5.30 and it's difficult. It is quite difficult. Isaac, I saw Isaac already. Hello, good evening, present. And um, to be honest, I don't have any random fact about me on, on, on mine right now. <laughs> but but uh, I can say that I'm currently fine, I guess. And that today was a little bit stressful. But everything went right okay. at the end. Yes. All right, great. Is it usually the the hardest day is on Thursday, or is even worse on Fridays? I think that, that it's even worse in uh, on on Monday. Before. Mondays are even yes. worse. All right. Yes. Well, in my case, it's the opposite. You know, Monday is probably not that bad, but as the week progress on Wednesday and Thursday and Friday, it start getting really bad, really bad sometimes. <laughs> All right. Just that that on Thursday and Friday, uh, uh, we I have like a a, a, a small uh, light of hope that the Saturday it's and coming. Sunday is coming. <laughs> yeah, probably that. A little bit motivated. Yeah, no, but today at work was like really, really tiring and it was raining when we... It was raining a lot. Yeah, yes. when we were supposed to leave work, it was raining. So that was what made it a little bit worse. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you for sharing. That. Yes. You're welcome. Hans. Present, Miss. Hi. I feel, 
Hi, good night. Mm -hmm. I feel so happy in my house with my children. They are okay? No, I, I'm fine. Okay, All right. okay. No. No, <laughs> All right. The children, All right. they are fine. Yes. Uh -huh. They went to school today? Uh, si, eh, si fueron a la escuela? Yes. Uh, no, no. They eh, están didn't go en, to school. No sé cómo se diría, pero están estudiando en línea. Online. 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 So, they continue online. Sí, por decisión de la mamá. Y, All right. Que no los puede cargar mi mamá para todas partes. It's okay, it's okay. But do you consider there is progress? Eh, sí, yes. They yes. are learning? Sí, este... No, como no manejo bien este idioma, ¿verdad? Pero sí, ahora estoy viendo las notas de mi hijo y solo ha sacado 10. La, la, la menor nota es 8.5. Wow, 8.5. Congratulations. 8.5. Yes. The lowest score is 8.5, and most of the scores are 10, so that's a good, good grade. Yes, thank you. All right. Oh, Margarita has permission. I'm going to write it later. All right. Let's see. Fernando has been waiting for this moment to speak. <laughs> Hello, Miss. Good evening. Good evening. Um, yes. The week is almost over and I feel super tired but this morning practice a little vocabulary 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 vocabulary, vocabulary. Mm -hmm. um, I need a vacation I need vacation <laughs> we just had vacation in August ah no I need more vacation no you didn't have vacations that's um, sad. In January. In January, you're going to have vacation. Pero oh. no me, pero, pero siempre las trabajo casi. Really? Yes. So uh, she needs the money. Yes. <laughs> True. Thank you, Fred. Uh, okay. Edith. Hello. Uh, I am sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> I am sleepy because it's raining. The, there was a lot of traffic. True. I usually spend about an hour and today I spent more than an hour to come home. There was a lot of traffic, it's true. But thank God, mm. yeah, I got home. Let's say on time mm -hmm. for this class, of course. All right, thank you, Eddie. Don't be a sleepy. Wake up. Get some water. Get some candies. <laughs> All right, Edgar. How many present? Hi. Uh, I I feel good. Uh, I'm happy to learn with you, everyone. With everyone, nice, good. I hope to practice a lot in class today. Yes. <laughs> Great, awesome. Diana Vanessa. Hi, present Miss. Continue. Okay. I feel so happy. Why? Because um ¿cómo se dice? How do you say in English una buena noticia? I have good news. I have good news. What is the good My news? My sister is um, res, se dice she got the residence of the USA. Uh -huh. No, 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 the in United States. Where? Sino in, 
en Europa. In Europe. In Europe. Wow, even better. She got the residence of Europe. Yes. Where exactly? Where does she live? Italy, Spain, France? Um, Italy. Italy. What city? Yes. Yes. In what city in Italy? Italy. Um, um, in Rome. Yes. No. Milan. Realmente no sé. <laughs> so you never go to visit your sister? Cuente, cuente. <laughs> no sé, este, real, no, no sé, pero solo sé que uh, está en la, en la, en la capital. En <laughs> Roma. Roma. Uh -huh. yes. Nice, we can go to visit your sister. That's good news. Estamos reunidos, así que si escuchan, voy a ver porque estamos celebrando. <laughs> it's, a, it's a virtual celebration. Perdón. A virtual celebration. Yes. Con, ah. eh, con, con, con pollo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice. <laughs> All right, great. Thank you for sharing. Sounds fun. All right, Blanca. Blanca, Blanca. Blanca, no, in, not in class today. Oh, no, that's too bad. Okay. Andrea, your turn. Present. I'm happy to be in my English class. I waited all day <laughs> for my class. <laughs> and I'm preparing myself mentally to travel to San Vicente tomorrow. Early. No way. I... What time? <laughs> um, Six. I go out my house like oh, Jesus. Don't you need an assistant? <laughs> <laughs> because when you drive and you are alone, sometimes it's boring. You get bored and you want to sleep. You stop at a gas station. You drink coffee. You dissimulate that you are getting bored. <laughs> it yes. happens to me. It's very relaxing, and I sometimes feel like I going to sleep. I can driving. drive. I can drive. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe we practice English. <laughs> I going to consider it. Please consider it. I can send you my resume. <laughs> and I'm going to be Andrea's assistant. Sounds fancy. Wow, good luck. Good luck. Enjoy San Vicente. San Vicente is beautiful. And very hot too. Yes, when you get to the city, it's very hot. But when you are on the road, the landscape is beautiful. You can see all the... Yeah, yes. the volcano, the valley, Hiboa Valley, and all the yes. landscape. Ah, exactly, the food is great. Well, yes. enjoy, bring something. <laughs> anyway, we Thank are you. neighbors. You just call me, here I am. <laughs> <laughs> and I can go to pick it up, all right? <laughs> oh, for, the, for the molienda season, it's really nice. It smells good, the sugar. <laughs> they, that they make in San Vicente. It's really good. I, I didn't know. Yeah, it, but the sugar season, the molienda season in January, February, I guess. Oh. Se siente el olor en la carretera. De la miel que se está cociendo para hacer el el dulce de panela. People from San Vicente know this. It's a secret they have. <laughs> yeah, but it's really good. San Vicente is really, really Salvadorian. De definitely, it's one of the departamentos más representativos, I think, of the San Salvadorian Vicente culture. Donde va toda la gente. <laughs> exactly. Orquesta San Vicente. No, it's true. They have orchestras. They are very, very cumbiamberos. True. <laughs> All right. And Marcy. Present. Hi. <laughs> Thanks to Andrea. I'm going uh, tomorrow out of San Salvador. I'm really? going to Sonsonate. 
Oh my god. So you both are driving far, far away tomorrow. Yes. And what do you like from San Sanate? Um, um, not much. <laughs> not much. Nothing. You don't like anything from San Sanate. It's hot. It's hot too. It's hot, but it's some tipo de calor different because it's from the coast, right? Because you're hot, um, hot and humid. Mm -hmm. humid. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes, true. Yes, and San Vicente is more similar to Cabañas and it's similar because it's, it's hot, but a different type of heat. <laughs> yes. All right, Blanca, you just joined us. Hello, good evening. Hello, thank you. How are you? I'm fine, fine. All right. Are you going to get a contar sobre este día or tomorrow or the weekend? Hay problemas con internet, por eso uh, Yes, no problem, don't worry. You say, oh, I have internet or some problems with the internet connection. Yes, all right, don't worry. Well, claps, good job. Todos los que hicieron el intento de comunicar algo en English, you see? You can do it, okay? <laughs> Solo es que se tiren. Yes, just do it, just do it. Por ahí dicen, solo hágalo. All right. So today we're gonna practice again. Let me get the okay, let me get this. I creo que ya les explicaba un poco o creo que lo mencioné. The fact that el there is y el there are no necesariamente tiene que ser para decir hay una oficina, hay una farmacia, hay un banco. Puede también ser usado con objetos, right? Con cosas, también en la casa o en el lugar de trabajo. Para el caso, el manual lo presenta así. Ok, this is what we started yesterday. Esto fue como el, la introduction de la lección de there is and there are. There is para singular, there are para plural. Y podemos usar algunos quantifiers. Como a lot of, some, no, right. Y en este caso, esta lección lo presenta para decir que... Facilities, los facilities son como las instalaciones, ¿sí? Como qué cosas tienen en las instalaciones de su trabajo. Obviamente, hay personas que, que, como hemos escuchado, que nos han comentado que no están como exactamente en un lugar específico, que les toca salir mucho, pero me imagino que el lugar de trabajo para otras personas son como las, las oficinas, las plantas de producción, o cualquier otras facilities que tengan en su lugar de trabajo. Regálenme un segundito que mi computadora se está muriendo. Just one second. Pueden estudiar los examples que están acá y luego vamos a comentar. Right? Mm -hmm. All right, so, en esta lesson dice que debemos poder describe how 
might in other working places and areas look like. Cómo lucen mis áreas de trabajo, qué cosas hay, qué cosas podemos ver, encontrar y también describirlas, ¿verdad? Ask classmates, preguntaré a los compañeros, ask a classmate which places are in your working place, how does your working area look like, and share. Bueno, los que ya pudieron observar, buscaron el, el manual, ¿verdad? Vieron que... Mr. Paz y Mrs. Aguilar describen su workplace. Practiquemos un ratito el acento. Give me a second. Y ahí sería, este es un lobby muy bonito y el otro sería... Son confortables estas salas, oh, perdón, estos cuartos sería, o rooms. Habitaciones. Habitaciones, ajá. Pero eso quiere decir, va, son. Son confortables habitaciones. Y el otro, there's a hoop. Y esa no sé qué quiere decir. A hoop party. Enorme. ¿Para qué o es muy grande? Ah, como lot. grande. Ajá, lot. Pero quiere decir estos parqueos o este parqueo. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, es como que este parqueo. Uh -huh. Ok. Good, There are good. Ok. Pero le digo que estoy haciéndole el favor. Eh, es una de la mañana prima, y primamos uno que diga a las 3 de la mañana y otro a las 5. All right, so we have Mr. Paz describing the workplace, right? And he says there is a Beautiful, beautiful lobby. There is a beautiful lobby, exactly. There are comfortable rooms. There are comfortable rooms. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo se dice eso? Comfortable. Comfortable. Yes. Comfortable. Uh -huh. Imagínense, a mí me lo enseñaron allá en el siglo pasado. Long comfortable. Ago. Comfortable, ahí me quedo grabado. De la Comfortable, de... yes. <laughs> All right. Next, there is a huge parking lot. Parking lot. And parking there are lot. three high tech elevators. Elevators, exactly. Vaya, solo con escuchar lo que Mr. Paz ha descrito. ¿Cómo lo ha descrito? Ustedes dirían, ¿en qué bueno, ¿y entonces dónde trabaja Mr. Paz? Si sí, hay un beautiful lobby, comfortable rooms, a huge parking lot, en uh -huh. high-tech elevators. Ajá. Uh -huh. En el Sheraton trabaja. <laughs> <laughs> he probably works in a hotel, definitely. Yeah. Hotels usually have a beautiful lobby, comfortable rooms, a huge parking lot. De hecho, a mí me parece interesante. No sé si yo estoy mal. Pero en los hoteles antes no se, parca, no se, para, no se pagaba el parking. Mm -hmm. Y hoy tienen no. hasta la misma maquinita que tienen los shopping centers. Sí. Por, es que la, la misma gente ha Algunos, tenido la culpa. No. Son los mismos es dueños que, de los negocios, ¿verdad? Lo que pasa, Miss, es que mucha gente dejaba, llegaba a dejar estacionado mm. su vehículo y agarraba un taxi o un bus. Y, y se iba. Y ya llegaba en la tarde a las 4 o 5 y llegaban a, 
eso mismo hacían en, la, en, en este multiplaza. Mm. Entonces, estaban llenos y la gente no andaba comprando, andaba en la, en la feria, ajá, o andaba en, en, otra, <risa> en, en el estadio, ahí dejaban los vehículos. Entonces, really? se dieron cuenta y por eso empezaron mm. a poner cobros. Interesting. Por lo mismo, por eso mismo. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Good reason, sí, tiene sentido, porque me imagino que igual había gente que llegaba, dejaba los autos y se iban hasta que Guatemala y regresaban en la noche a sacar el auto. Ajá, uh -huh. Uh -huh. ajá, así es. Que somebody, somebody told me, alguien me contó que usted, pero ahora se puede como gestionar en un hotel, no voy a decir el name, pero que usted uh -huh. puede gestionar que, que le dejen dejar su auto ahí todo el día por five dollars. Bueno. Ajá, y si if you have the necessity, pues imagino que you can do it. Right? A mí una vez me pusieron una multa en esos parquímetros de San Salvador. <risa> 7.50 de dólar. My goodness. Y valía sí, como 3 dólares, creo, valía la tarjeta. Mm. Y le duraba, creo que 50 horas, algo así. Wow. Uh -huh. Yes, well. Uh -huh. Nunca Maybe. vence. Sí, de, esos, de esos parquímetros. Que, Pero ya no existen, están... ¿verdad? ¿O sí? Sí, sí, ahí hay todo. Yo no sé si los quitaron hoy con la remodelación. Creo que sí. Uh -huh. Ajá, Creo que sí lo que yo veo son los lugares esos que tienen las maquinitas esas. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok. Now, Miss Aguilar. Uh -huh. De hecho, aquí debería haber una e. S. Ok, Miss Aguilar. There is a narrow reception area. There are two dirty dining rooms. There is an ugly photocopy center. And there are small offices. Qué contraste. <laughs> okay, beautiful lobby. Comfortable rooms. Huge parking, high-tech elevator, y esto es todo lo contrario. Narrow, significa reducida, angosta, pequeña. Reception area. Dirty dining rooms. Dirty significa sucio. There are two dirty dining rooms. There is an ugly photocopy center. Ugly, feo. And there are small offices. Y oficinas pequeñas. What is her workplace? Posible sea una de esas pensiones que le dicen. O un hotelito de esos que le dicen de mala mujer. <laughs> A poor hotel. <laughs> Ok. Mm, all right. Pero hay oficinas. Small Present. offices. Uh -huh. A call center. A call center. <laughs> A possibility. Uh -huh. Narrow reception area. O oficinas de gobierno, tal vez. <laughs> The government. Aunque ahora no creo, ¿verdad? Mm. They have improved. Yeah. Algunas. Depends. It depends. Uh, yes, depends. Mm -hmm. Ugly for a copy center. Could be. Mm -hmm. Could be an office from government. Okay, well, it's also a prediction there. No, es como que. Sí, así es. No. It's just a guess. They say, adivinar. Guess. Right? Read the description of Mr. Paz and Mrs. Aguilar Workplace. And can you guess? Pueden adivinar dónde trabaja. Ok. Luego tenemos estas information questions. Read the information again to answer the questions. Compare with the partner. How does Mr. Paz describe his workplace? ¿Cómo describe el señor Paz su lugar de trabajo? What does Miss Aguilar think about her workplace? ¿Y qué piensa Miss Aguilar de su, trabajo, de su lugar de trabajo? 
On which of the two places do you want to work and why? ¿Y en cuál de los dos lugares a usted le gustaría trabajar y por qué? I know, me van a decir, así es obvio, la respuesta es obvia, pero the idea is that you practice. Vamos a ver. Acá, aparte de que estamos practicando there is and there are, también vamos a aprender palabras nuevas que describen cosas, que describen lugares como beautiful, comfortable, huge, high tech. High tech es tecnología de punta, ¿verdad? High tech es como high technology. Narrow, dirty, ugly, small. ¿Hay alguna duda con la pronunciación de estas new words, de este nuevo vocabulary? Yes or no? Eh, what is pronunciation? Elevate, elevators. 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 Mm -hmm. Y photos, photos. Photos. Photos, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Miss. Miss. Yes. Le dice, there is an... Narrow on, ¿cómo se cómo Narrow. Sería? Narrow. Narrow. Uh -huh. Narrow reception. Narrow. Reception area. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Gracias. All right. Ok, vamos a practicar. Miss, yes? tell me. Y Forge. Huge. 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 Esto, grandísimo. Mm. Grande, muy grande, espacioso. Con muchos spaces. Huge, huge. Vamos a practicar obviamente las primeras veces leyendo, ¿verdad? Y apoyando a los compañeros en caso que necesiten reforzar la pronunciación. Lo van a leer tal cual está acá. Si la primera vez mi compañero leyó sobre Mr. Paz y yo leí sobre Mrs. Aguilar, luego intercambiamos y así vamos. Luego que hayan hecho esa practice de leer, de pronunciar, van a responder las questions. Además, van a tratar de escribir al menos tres oraciones de cosas que hay en el lugar donde ustedes trabajan. ¿Ya? Si yo fuera a describir mi lugar de trabajo, yo diría, There is a clean cafeteria. There are... Some beautiful chairs. There is a... Um, there is a comfortable uh, reception area. There are small offices, but there are beautiful classrooms. Okay? Because I work in a school. Pero ustedes obviamente traen en otros lugares. Pueden decir, there is a gym, there is a restaurant, I don't know, there is a cafeteria, there are offices or clean offices, there are, what else, trees, there are plants, there are beautiful windows, there are high-tech computers. ¿Qué hay en su trabajo? ¿Ya? Entonces son tres cosas. Primero, Practice, reading, practice the pronunciation, practice the vocabulary. La idea es que describamos algo. Cuando yo les digo, there are many windows. Hay muchas ventanas en el lugar de trabajo. It's fine. Pero, si lo quieren enfatizar, podrían decir, there are beautiful windows. Yes? So that is the idea. ¿Hay alguna question? ¿Está la instrucción clara? ¿Is the instruction clear? Yes. Ok, perfecto. Ok, let me see. A ver qué dice. Ini, mini, my, ni, mo. Ok. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes. Here we go.
show reception area, uh, area, area, no sé. area. There are two dirty dining rooms. Así era. Dining rooms. Mm -hmm. Dining rooms. Miss. Dining rooms. How is the pronunciation? Yes, dining room. It's correct. Dining. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. There is an ugly photocopy center. There are small offices. Office. Office. Okay. One more time. Ah, you know. <laughs> Next. Mariana. Okay. There is a beautiful lobby. There are a comfort comfortable rooms. Comfortable. Okay. There are comfortable rooms. There are huge parking lots. There, there are there high tech elevator. La otra. Miss. Yes. Aquí estaba Rodrigo y se fue. O oh, no sé qué pasó. <risa> se tuvo que mover porque alguien se había quedado solo. No, I'm sorry. Bueno, me asusté. <risa> me desesperan de así. Sin previo aviso. Bye. <risa> <risa> y las emis y las preguntas. Ah, ahorita se las comparto. Don't worry. Por favor. There is a narrow reception. Reception. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice área? Ar área. Área. Creo que sí. Reception area. Área. There are two dirty dining rooms. There is a ugly, ugly for cop center. There are is my office. In the other. There is a beautiful lobby. There are comfort. Como dijo la misa esa palabra. Ay. Comfort. Co sí, comfort. Creo que sí. Comfort. Comfort. Comfortable. 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 Como que llevara ese. Comfort. Conf, con F. Comfortable. Comfortable. Uh -huh. Como Conf. Comfort. Uh -huh. Comfortable. Mm, no se lee la R. No. There are comfta comfortable rooms. Conf. Uh -huh. Comfortable. Comfortable. O sea, no se lee ni la O ni la R. Uh -huh. Comfortable. Y el U Conf. que, ¿cómo se pronuncia? ¿El cual? En la palabra que huge. se escribe. Huge. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo es? There is a huge. 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 Es huge. Exacto. Huge. Huge. There are. There is a. Similar a height. Es huge. Yes. Huge. Parking lot. There are the there are three high comfortable comfortable acaba de entrar teacher sí acaba de decirlo ahí comfortable creo que comfortable 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 algo así comfortable comfortable yes hasta con hasta con un nudito en la lengua <laughs> conf, conf, la F, con, comfortable. Comfortable. Mm -hmm. Comfortable. Entonces, Blanca. There, there is a beautiful lobby. There are comfortable. Ah. O, o, puede ser, o puede ser como it. It has, it has a beautiful lobby. Como para decir, es, es un hermoso, eh, como, eh, 
el lobby es porque el, el, el lobby es como una como sala de estar no sé cómo decirle ajá porque está hablando como de, de eso no sé si ese sería it has a beautiful look Yes, it's it possible, has. it's possible, pero tratemos de usar el there is, como hay, is. there is. Ah, para decir entonces there, there is. is. There is uh, o there are. Ah, uh -huh. oh, tenemos que hacer there is, there are. Exactly. Ah, oh, ok, ok. Ah, pues sí, there, there is a beautiful lobby. Uh -huh. De ahí sería la segunda, dice, what does... Mrs. Aguilar think about her work, workplace. ¿Qué es lo que piensa? Yes, there is a beautiful lobby. There's a, there are comfortable rooms. There's a huge parking lot. There are three high-tech elevators. Del. Eh, esa, esa, esa última, ¿cómo, mm -hmm. ¿cómo se lee? There, there are. There are three high-tech uh -huh. high high eleva elevators. High-tech elevator. Ok, ahora voy yo. Mm -hmm. There is a, a beautiful lobby. There are com comfortable rooms. There are few parking lot. There are three high tech high tech high tech high table. Así como cuando la regañan. Hi, hi. Ay, ay, por todas. Hi. Cuando la descubren que agarró algo de la red. Hi. Okay. Hi, te que le va a ir. Elevator. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. There is there a are... narrow. There is. First. Así se escribe first, ¿verdad? First place. Uh -huh. No sería at the. ¿Verdad que sí? At the. First place. Dice why. Uh -huh. Because it looks like a better workplace. Es que casi no les escucho, perdonen que no les está ayudando mucho. Yo digo que podemos poner como que porque parece un mejor lugar. Ah, mira, ahí no le puedes ahí great, great place to work. <laughs> ah, también. Because it's a great great place to work. Right? It's a great place to work. Vaya, ¿las van a escribir? Ya, estuvo. Ay, yo no. Qué lenta. Qué lenta. Estaba escribiendo para todos. Este paz de me disculpen que no les estoy poniendo mucho no les estoy ayudando mucho pero voy a ay tenemos que hacer las tres oraciones de nuestro lugar de trabajo verdad there are three high tech elevators como se dice elevators Elevators. Elevators. Mm -hmm. y, y la otra. Yes. Es narrow. Narrow. ¿Verdad? Narrow. 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 Okay. 
Kungan. Kungan. Yes, narrow. Hai, ke pas ini. What happened? Tak boleh, tak boleh. Miss en la primera pregunta dice how does Mr. Pass describe his workplace? Mm -hmm. Is a there is a beautiful lobby, there are comfortable rooms. Mm -hmm. de, todo eso vamos a poner. Mm, o sea, todo eso en resumen, ¿cómo lo describe? ¿Cómo lo ver? ¿Qué? It's a beautiful workplace. Exactly. He thinks it's a beautiful workplace. He describes his workplace as a beautiful place. A ver, a ver, a ver. Le puedo poner solo, it's a beautiful workplace. Workplace. Mm -hmm. ah. Workplace. Y el otro sería lo contrario. Exactly. Ok. Contestar las que están, ¿verdad? Ahorita, ahorita voy, a, voy, a, voy a compartir la otra. Ok. Ajá. Dice, who does Mr. Paz des describe his workplace? ¿Cómo Mr. Paz describe su lugar de trabajo? Vamos a ver, sería, si mal no recuerdo. Tenemos que detallar todo lo que él dice en su lugar de trabajo. Algo así. Dice, dice, dice que es un, tiene un bonito lobby, un beautiful lobby, ¿no? Ajá. Ajá. Contestemos Ajá. ahí. Si vos... Me, este... Sí, no sé si sería, si sería. Sí, sería, sí, la verdad, esa última sí, no, no soy muy segura. Miss, no, no nos podría ayudar con la última, como, como. Este, vea que ahí nos está preguntando que, que, que cuál escogeríamos nosotros para ser el mejor lugar para trabajar. Exactly, ¿y por qué? Ajá, el por qué sí lo tenemos, pero, eh, el, el, o sea, para contestar es. Ah, que... I prefer. Ajá. I prefer, Mr. Or Mrs. Aguilar. Ah, Likewise. entonces sería I prefer Miss El Mr. Pass Workplace or Mrs. Aguilar Workplace. I prefer. Uh -huh. Esa palabra era I prefer. <laughs> I prefer. Uh -huh. Hola. Mr. Mr. Pass. Eh, en la siguiente estaría bien. Que dice bien. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. A narrow. Ajá. Uh -huh. no. Doble R. A narrow. Ajá. Así. W. Ajá. Red Station. Ah, pero es con E, con T, reception. Ajá, uh -huh. reception. Reception. Area. Área. Uh -huh. Ese es lo primero que vio este señor. Uh -huh. Toma. Eh, que estaba sucio lo, esas cosas. El, la primera es que la, la recepción es estrecha. El área ese de recepción. Que, ah, perdón, ese que estaba Ajá. estrecho. Después que las fotos ah, estaban. Ahí dice que la, there are two. Es eh, como estoy compartiendo, sí. no, puedo, no puedo subir a donde estaba. Vaya, entonces pongo en la otra. Eh, eh, ¿eh? Are. There are two, two dirty dinners room. Es lo que estaba sucio. Uh -huh. Ok Vamos por allá A ver si cabe aquí uh -huh. esto There There are 
Este. Uh -huh. T-O-W, este, este W. -O. <ríe> sí. Pero ahí son dos, de a tú. Así va, pero de a tú. Dirty. Dirty. Dini room. Uh -huh. Dini room. Uy. Ah, no, 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 esa. No, ¿cómo no? There are, there are two dining sí. room. Así es, solo quiero ver algo. Dining. Sí, así va. Aquí la vamos a hacer un poquito más ancha. Ahí está. Y había otra. Este es a small office. Ajá, este también es plural. Uh -huh. There are Hello. Hi, ready? Miss, yes. eh, how do you say in English eh, escaleras o gradas? Las gradas para ir al, seg al segundo nivel, al segundo piso. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Stairs. ¿Y cómo se escribe? How do you spell? <ríe> Ahorita se las escribo. S T A I R S. Stairs. S T A I R S. Uh -huh. the stairs to the second floor. Stairs. Ah, okay, okay. The stairs. Stairs. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, there are a big stairs. You describe your workplace? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. All right. Perfect. Practice. Mm -hmm. es, esas oraciones cuando describan sus workplaces lo van a tener que decir ya en la reunión general. All right. Okay. <ríe> okay. <ríe> so, así que si no, si no han practicado con sus partners, va a ser más difícil. Así que practiquen con sus partners. Okay. Bye. Manuel dijo que ya las tenía, así que las puede leer primero. Sí, sí, sí. Está copiando esas ideas. O sea, sería de contestar, digamos, algo así como his work, his workplace, how. Uh -huh. Has. No. Has. Has. Uh -huh. ¿Por qué es tercera persona? Has. Has. Entonces ya, digamos, cuando contestamos sería His work, por lo menos en Mr. Paz His work place has Ajá A beautiful lobby Has Comfortable room Has huge parking lot Has Three high teach Elevators Así, has, en todo has Teacher Sería muy repetitivo Ajá, por eso Pero sí es correcto, sí es correcto, aunque también pueden hacerlo usando there is, there are. There are. There is o there are. Pero si okay. quieren decirlo con has, también es correcto. Ah. O sea que si lo queramos usar there is y there are sería como his work where there is a lot of In yes, in his workplace, there is this, this, and this. Yes. Oh. Pero en resumen, ¿cómo describe él su lugar de trabajo? Ok. As a good, bad, terrible, interesting, nice place. 
A nice place. Mm -hmm. He described his workplace as a nice place, as a good place, as a beautiful place, right? Teacher. Mm -hmm. Y, y este, cuando dice la tercera pregunta, on which, ¿qué es which? Se me olvida. ¿En cuál de los dos trabajos a usted le gustaría trabajar? ¿Y por qué? ¿Cuál? ¿Cuál de los dos? Vamos a hacer en la tercera, I wish. Or I like. To work. Uh -huh. I like to work. Ah. Uh -huh. In Mr. Pass place or Mrs. Pass, Mr. Pass workplace because this, 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 and this. Usando siempre lo. Yes, la, there is and there are. The, the information. Exactly. Okay. Más o menos, Java. Esa. There are many trucks at my work. There are many trucks at my work. Uh -huh. Hay muchos, muchos eh, camiones en su. En mm -hmm. su. Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Lo voy a cruzar. No sé cómo decir para el mío. Eh, ¿Cómo? Puede ser como there, there is a place where I visit many many doctors and, and nurses. ¿En un lugar donde? There is a place where uh -huh. I visit many doctors and nurses como que es, es un lugar en donde visito muchos muchos médicos y, y enfermeras visito yes it's correct it's correct Marce. but no tiene como un lugar específico una oficina o una clínica donde digamos que es como su base no, o sea, sí tenemos como una oficina, pero no, no pasamos nosotros ahí. O sea, paso uh -huh. yo más tiempo, digamos, en las mañanas. Uh -huh. Yo visito seguros y hospitales. Ok. Y me paso entonces, como movilizando y en la tarde también uh -huh. paso. Entonces ahí. puede escribir como los hospitales. Y las clínicas. Oh. Uh -huh. There are many offices, there are many patients, o oh, there are uh, doctor's offices, there are many nurses. Ah, uh -huh. ajá, entonces sería como there are many, many clinics. Uh -huh. Para describir como tal vez un hospital. Ajá, como la generalidad de esos lugares a los que a usted le toca ir. Ah, oh, uh -huh. ok. There are reception uh -huh. areas. Uh -huh. There are offices, there are uh hospital equipment probably uh -huh. Uh -huh. Entonces, sería como, there are many 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 medical e equipment equipment uh -huh. equipment yes equipment. oh uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. all right thank you Edgar la tuya que qué significa la, es la frase Una zona de descarga. Oh. Mm -hmm. There is a download zone. Ah, down, download zone. Mm -hmm. es, que es como igual como en internet. Download como usted dice, voy a descargar algo de internet. Download. Porque descargan, ¿qué? Trucks, ¿verdad? Producto, oh. raw material. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Es como una factory. Oh. Uh -huh. Una factory. Generalmente las bodegas descargan los, los trucks o también los cargan si van a exportar o van a, a mover eh, producto terminado, right? Okay. I know where Edgar works. Ah, mentira. <ríe> lo que pasa es que I work in a, in a similar company. Solo que en la company para la que yo trabajo y en esta parte de responsabilidad social. Entonces, I work in the foundation. Pero sí, o sea, 
juntas, conozco más o menos me gustan todas esas otras áreas. Es como una ONG. Exacto, pero dentro de una empresa. Oh. Ajá, y la, la patrocina la empresa. Y la empresa produce calzado. Oh. They make shoes. Qué interesante. Uh -huh. And they have this uh, program to benefit uh, teenagers who want to study English, computing, and values. Son como, como similar a FUSAL? Exacto, oh, son yeah. programas empresariales. Como, ah, es que ellos tenían uno que se llamaba Superate. Exacto, I work for Superate. Oh. <laughs> But I work in Sayapango. I am in ah. book. Yo, yo fui a, a, a evaluar. Really? No, sí. La voy a invitar. So you were the nutritionist in Superate. Sí. sí. Nice. Pero con, pero con, con Fusal. Sí, ellos, ellos son los, los el patrocinador de ellos es Puma. Sí, sí. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Pero now they are in Santa Tecla. Pues a... ellos, ellos pertenecen al mismo programa. Ajá. In, in... In 2040, mm. I go 14. to 14. 14. Yes. I initiated. I, go, I uh, go to in uh, in Santa Tecla in near yeah. uh, Paseo del Carmen. Paseo del Carmen. Mm -hmm. True. Mm -hmm. There is another one in in Plan de la Laguna from Merle. Ah, ahí ahí ya no fue. Uh -huh. There is another one in San Juan Pico from Ilazal. I, I see. Uh -huh. And there's an, there are two in Sayapango, one in eh, well, Polideportivo España. Ah, uh -huh. And sí. there is another one in Adoc, near Plaza Mundo. Y la sala is uh, beautiful. Yes, ah, but, like, but you, have, like you, have, you have to visit Adoc. Oh. You have never been there. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's a huge company. It's similar. Actually, the owners are fami family. Oh. Mm -hmm. They are related. And the, there are four more in Panama. It's a big. It's a big program, yes. Oh, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's Not why it. I know these areas. Great conversation. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Quiero ver, si encuentro la foto se la enseño, porque nice. sí, fue, fue bien bonito. Ah, la vamos a invitar. De hecho, yo tengo que contactar a usted y a Andrea, porque I have, I have a question, a personal question, que no le puedo hacer en la clase, and then I forget, porque my day I'm very busy at work. <laughs> I, I need a program from you too. <laughs> <laughs> y porque Andrea dice que vive por acá. She's my neighbor. De verdad. Mm -hmm. wow. Pero le dije que me traiga algo de San Vicente tomorrow. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. She's going to San Vicente. Yeah, she is. All right, uh, continue. I'm sorry for the interrupting. <laughs> I don't find the, the picture. Um, Ah, aquí. Este. This is a nice. Y la sal. Yes, I see. Todavía estaba Nati. Yes, true. Ajá. Uh -huh. Cool. Nice remembers. Yeah. A ver, otro, dele, dele Edgar, otro. Are you ready to describe your workplace? So, so. So, so, I'm yeah. still working, I'm still in progress. Ya yeah, completo. Um, all right, perfect. This meeting is being recorded.
Hi. All right, second attendance antes de que me cuenten de su workplace. Y aquí solo cosas positivas. No. <laughs> There is a video. <laughs> As evidence, okay. Let's see. Let's say present, please. <laughs> right. Marce. Present. Andrea. Present. Blanca. Diana, present. Edgar, <laughs> Edith, Fernando, present. Glenda Margarita has permission. Hands, present, Miss. Isaac, también pido permiso para traer a su father from a hospital. Poor Isaac. Daniel, present. Jocelyn, not here. Manuel. Present. Oscar. Rene. <laughs> Present, Miss. Raul. Present. Rodrigo. Present. And Sandra. Present. Hi, Sandra. What happened to you? Are you ready? Ajá. Let's describe our workplace. Vamos a ver, vamos a iniciar con mini, 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 more. Vamos a iniciar con alguien que no esté ni al inicio ni al final de la lista. Con Fernando. <risa> Sentí esa, esa, esa. <risa> O sea, como que lo presentía. Ay. Una vibra positiva. Go. Ok. Uh, the, my work. Yes. yes. Practice the. No, your original <laughs> sentences. <laughs> so sad. So sad. So good. Es a three. Three oh, sentences, right? Okay. At least three, but if you want to say five or six, it's fine, no problem. No, yeah, just three. Right. Three, three. Uh, right? <laughs> just three. There is a beautiful dining room. There is a good work environment. There is a good environment. There is a Good working environment. Uh -huh. Yes. And there is a pretty window. There's a pretty window. All right. Awesome. Good Quiero clap. ver esa reaction. <laughs> Only no, one clap. No, ya les... no, no. hasta que el chiste no. Ya no, no participar, <laughs> Fernando. <laughs> ok, Fernando. You... Say a name. Ah, quiero ver. Del 1 al 16. Quiero a ver. name. Say a partner's espera, name. Espera, quiero ver. A Marcela. <risa> Welcome. Es que se estaba riendo. Fue con, fue con dolor. <risa> Es que sí estaba riendo por eso. Liar. A ver. There is... No, there are... Uh, are many clinics. Mm -hmm. There are, are many... Medical equipment. Equipment. Yeah. And there are, are many doctors and nurses. Yes. That's great. Nice. Say your name, Marcel. Uh, Blanca. Blanca. Describe your workplace, please. 
my my workplace mm -hmm. there are uh, there are um, big spaces big spaces mm -hmm. and there are some, um, some uh, green green areas there are green areas uh -huh, the green area my my workplace there are um, Camino es Camino a on the way on on the way on the way um, carretera los chorros on the way to los chorros on the way to los chorros mm -hmm. Nice. All right. Say a name. Um, <coughs> Diga el nombre de alguien más. <laughs> Miguel Ramírez. I think Miguel is not participating. Solo está como listener. Listener. Who? Uh, Raúl Campos. Raúl. Raúl. All right. Raúl Campos. Hi. Mira, ese your turn my turn yes please there are many trucks at my work mm -hmm. there else? is a a swimming pool there is a a place with eh, como muchas oficinas there are many offices many offices mm -hmm. there is a many office mm -hmm. y there are for eh, Pisos? Floors. There are four floors. Four. There are four floors. Oh my God, it's a big place. Yes, yes. All right, say a name. Elija alguien más. Edith. Edith. <laughs> Lo esperaba, no sé por qué, pero lo esperaba. Ok. Ok. Eh, the, there are no. uh, shine in the production. Uh -huh. Merchandise. Eh, ajá, merchandise uh -huh. in the production. Uh -huh. eh, there are comfortable offices. There are comfortable offices. Uh -huh. There are many windows. Nice. Good job. Say a name. Uh, Daniel. Daniel. <laughs> My my workplace mm -hmm. um, there is no boss physical there is a full kitchen mm -hmm. there is a video game room 
there is a break room. Wow. Your yes. job, in your workplace is, is very funny. Very interesting. Yes. Nice. All right, say a name. <laughs> Andrea. Andrea, <laughs> wake up. <laughs> okay. There is a clean cafeteria. There are a comfortable meeting rooms. There are a big stairs to the second floor. Nice. Good job. Say a name. Mm. Oscar René. <laughs> Present, Miss. <laughs> <laughs> okay. In my work, work work is uh, there. There are uh, many farms. There, there are uh, many chicken baby. Yes. Baby chicks. Baby chick. Right. There are. There are uh, beautiful gardens. Three. <laughs> All right. Three yeah. only. Three Estoy only. esperando que diga más. Ah, <laughs> and, there are uh, uh, because many. Because you, you work for uh, production, chicken production plant? Yes. Oh, it's chicken production. <laughs> Free chicken. <laughs> <laughs> chicken baby. Oh. Yes. All right. Did you say a name? Um, Jocelyn. Jocelyn. She's not here. Yeah, no, no, no. She's gone. <laughs> ah, vamos a dar una... <laughs> vamos a ver entonces por acá. Vamos a dar un tour por donde están los partners participants ahí cabalito en ese icono de yes. <ríe> sí. vamos a ver al ah, jefe Manuel Mena <ríe> the boss the, the boss quién hizo la música va a decir Ok. Uh, there is a big window for watch the garden. Uh, there are many PC or personal computers in which area. And there is in the office a uh, stereo for listening to music. All day. Wow. But, but no worry. <laughs> it doesn't work. <laughs> okay. Yeah. There is a stereo to listen to music, but you are not allowed to listen to music. Uh -huh. dancing, dancing to music. <laughs> Only on lunchtime. Only listen. listen. <laughs> All right. Nice. Good job. Somebody else? Alguien que no haya participado, raise your hand. Ahí está la posibilidad. Uh -huh. partner, Hans. Diana, Hans, exactly. Hi, hi. In my in my work place is they are is no there there is a beautiful garden. Mm -hmm. They are many tires. E there is a small reception. A small reception. Wow, nice. Good job. Next is Mr. Aguilar. Gracias, gracias. <laughs> <laughs> there, there is a many office and desks. There are many offices and desks. Uh, there, there, there are a many offices and desks. Uh, there are a beautiful meeting rooms. Uh, there are um, many windows and como se dice grande, un jardín grande. Garden. A big garden. A big garden. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is a big garden. 
All right, nice. Good job, Edgar. Uh, in my work, I have a special shop. In my work, there is a special reason. In my work, there, there are beautiful windows. Nice. In my work, there is a Repeat. In my work, there is a gate. Gas station. A gas station. Wow. <laughs> what is the name of your workplace? Don't smoking, eh? <laughs> Don't smoke. No, be careful. What is the name of your workplace? ¿Cómo se llama esa empresa? Yo trabajo para Robertoni, pero la empresa es otra la que le ofrece la, la seguridad. Ah, all right, nice. Interesting. Good job. Okay, nice. All right, alguien que no haya participado, somebody? Somebody like Rodilna. <laughs> <laughs> Rodrigo, did you participate? Hello? Did you participate? Not yet. Uh, exercise with your partner. Uh, you just practice with your partner. Mm -hmm. mm, all right. And now? Okay. Please go. <clears throat> no please. All right, no problem. Yes. Describe your workplace. Uh, my workplace is a uh, a three level. Three floors, three levels. Three, three high tech, see three floor. Mm -hmm. There is a uh, a uh, parking to parking. Uh, site mm -hmm. is area of the lugar de parqueo. Like parking spaces or parking lots? Uh, parking lots. Mm -hmm. There are two parking lots. Uh, there is a, a beautiful lobby. Mm -hmm. And there are uh, comfortable rooms. Comfortable rooms. All right, nice. Good job. Nice, excellent. All right. Nobody else? Ya todos participaron. Sure? Bye. Pues. Si no, su conciencia. <laughs> su conciencia les dirá. Just... Ay, yo ya lo describí. I described my workplace before. There is a soccer field in a cancha de fútbol in the company. <laughs> there are interesting, beautiful, and well equipped classrooms. There are many chairs. There are many tables because of the students. There are many computers. There is no atili. <laughs> <laughs> there are comfortable offices, there is a relaxing waiting area, there is a library, there are two computer labs, there is, well, there are many gardens, and there are two entrance, I love portones, and what else? There are production plants. 
There is a cafeteria, a beautiful cafeteria, open space for cafeteria. There are many tables outside for seating, for relaxing. So I think that's my workplace. I'm back. Yes, Isaac. How did it go? That was super fast. Uh, kinda. Uh, it went everything okay. Everything okay? Yes, uh, my dad is already in home. So. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Yes, he'll be fine. All right. So this is the activity that you were working on. You already finished. We practiced the vocabulary. And you answered the question. Uh -huh. How does Mr. Paz describe his workplace? That's a good place. He describes his workplace beautiful and comfortable beautiful and comfortable exactly and very good and what does miss aguilar think about her workplace it's a uh, ugly <laughs> it's an ugly workplace she thinks yeah it's not very nice right and which of the two places do you want to work and why I like to work number one. Yes, I like to work number one because because have a beautiful lobby and comfort comfortable room. In a huge parking space. <laughs> a huge parking lot, right? Nice. Because it, it sounds better, right? All right. So Acá también les explican algunos adjetivos pueden ser positivos, eh, otros pueden tener connotación negativa. Ok, one second, please. All right, as I mentioned, comfortable, huge, nice, illuminated, dan la idea de que están dando una característica positiva. Si yo digo, ah, es que este cuarto es comfortable, o sea, este, este cuarto es cómodo, confortable, right? Pero, por el contrario, si digo narrow reception area, es muy angosto, muy reducido, estamos todo apretado ahí, entonces, esta es una connotación negativa. Los adjectives son palabras que describen cosas, lugares, personas. En este caso tenemos obviamente adjectives que describen espacios, lugares, como el working area. O the workplace, right? Comfortable, there are comfortable rooms, there is a huge parking lot. O sea que no voy a andar buscando donde parquearme, so there is a lot of space, right? There are nice place. There are nice places to rest. There's a, an illuminated training room. O sea, un, un training room, un lugar, una sala de, de entrenamiento, de capacitación con buena iluminación, right? There is a narrow reception area. Un área de recepción muy pequeñita, muy angosta. There are small offices. En oficinas pequeñas. There is a disgusting kitchen area. O sea, un lugar de cocina, pero que es desagradable. There is a smelly living room. Y que hay un living room, o sea, una sala. Creo que huele mal. Eso es smelly. ¿Ok? Entonces, lo que estamos diciendo de este lugar o la característica, ya sea positiva, o negativa la ubicamos antes del lugar, ¿ya? Se dice, there is a beautiful living room. Or there is a nice waiting room. Y entonces, ¿cómo es? Lo pongo antes. ¿Sí? ¿Estamos claros hasta acá? Yes. Clear. All right. Perfect. 
Entonces, acá nos dan un exercise. ¿Qué es lo que debemos hacer? Vamos a completar la sentence usando palabras que ya no están en paréntesis. ¿Cómo nos quedaría la primera? Vamos a usar there is y there are, recuerden. There sí. is. Uh -huh. There is. A small gym. gym. There is a small gym. Vale, lo vamos a ir haciendo de una vez para que no se estrese, tranquila, relax. A beautiful color. There is a small gym. ¿Quién tiene un small gym en su trabajo? Nobody. <laughs> Nobody. No, yeah. Ah, pero en el trabajo de Daniel, there is a oh, video nice. game room. <laughs> ¿Y quién juega ahí, mister? Todos. En la hora del, res, del recess, nada más. ¿sí? Lunch. Y después, uh -huh. y después running para el trabajo otra vez. No, en, en, my, yes. en my workplace también there is a ping pong table. Que qué bulla. <laughs> Yo silence, I'm pitching. <laughs> All right. Okay, there's a small gym, number two. ¿Cuántos number two tenemos? Perdón, vamos a ver este. Ajá, training rooms. ¿Este está en singular o en plural? Plural. Plural. Uh -huh. Entonces. There are, there there are, are new training new rooms. Training rooms. There are new training rooms. Right? There are new training rooms. Aquí está bien. Nuevos. Ok, cafeterias, singular o plural? Plural. Uh -huh. There is. There are. There are. Clean. Clean. Cafeterias. Cafeterias, exactly. All right, meeting room. There is. There is. Uh -huh. There is. A smart, smart meeting room. There's a smart meeting room. Interesante, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo sería un smart meeting room? Vamos a ver. It's a TV. Project. Mm -hmm. PC. PC game. Exactly, with technology, right? To communicate, to have video conferences, right? That is a smart meeting room. TV at... Uh, uh, 8, 8, uh, HD. 8, 8, 8. <laughs> a smart TV. Beautiful. Uh, with a smart gadgets, right? Mm -hmm. Bathrooms. That is singular or plural? Plural. 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 So, there are. There are. Oh, wait a second. No me está dejando escribir. There are. Mm -hmm. And listen. listen. So this What does mean that? Yes, word. unpleasant. Back home. Back home. Unpleasant. Uh-huh. Unpleasant. ¿Qué significa, teacher? Desagradable, poco placentero. Okay. Mm -hmm. O sea, no hay nada más feo que entrar a un unpleasant. Un baño poco... Un baño poco placentero. <risa> un trono bastante incómodo. Exacto. Ok, no sé si han visto de repente que los, los bathrooms... Es un poco irónico, pero me ha pasado que a veces el lugar es nice, beautiful restaurants, por ejemplo, pero la puerta del bathroom no tiene acá. Like, a veces uno no cabe. Exactly. And how am I supposed to turn around? Y yo digo, eso no coincide. Súper incómodo. No coincide con el restaurant. Algo está pasando. <laughs> exactly. O quizás no hicieron todo el lugar, el exactly, y no dejaron space for the bathroom. Y en cambio, en otros places, the bathroom is... 
Hasta ah, puede bailar la comida un... bien mala. <ríe> pues, no, no, pero en, por ejemplo en hotels o en theaters, the bathrooms are beautiful. Hasta hay gente ahí watching videos, taking photos. <ríe> y yo, ok, hello. <ríe> All right. Quiero salir And... la foto. <laughs> Number six. Very a tiny. There is a tiny, tiny cubicle. Un cubículo muy pequeño. Ese es tiny. Como es como tiny. saber cómo pronunciar todas esas palabras. No sé, I don't know. <laughs> I just learned the words. <laughs> like. Teaching, no sé, you learn, yo... you learn different words. A veces me topo con, con cosas que. No, digo, but tiny. Do you remember tú? the tiny tunes? That little, little, little tiny. That's I tiny. remember. Uh -huh. I remember. Uh -huh. De ahí viene esa palabra. Looney tunes, tiny tunes. ¿Cómo se dice tiny? Tiny. No, en la siguiente palabra. Cubicle. 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 Yes. Cubicle. Repeat. Cubicle. Cubicle. <laughs> nice. René is a good teacher. <laughs> he insists <laughs> after me. <laughs> he insists. Repeat, please. <laughs> Repeat. Hasta que la diga bien. Exactly. Like the twisters. No sé si alguna vez hubo algún teacher que los puso a hacer trabalenguas en English. Yes. Mm. <laughs> Casi lloraba y ya lo dije bien. Really? Yes. I had... La lengua la trababa. <laughs> uh -huh. I had teachers que no nos daban notas. Y, o sea, era como que nos quedaban malas notas y no lo lográbamos decir. I learned a lot. Like Igual que cantar. Is... About... Yes, exactly. Like singing. Cantar, down there. pero cantar en... Eh, eh. A capela y yo como que O sea, como voy a poner una canción A capela y, and you were like Here There <laughs> Singing Char you say Yes, I can say a lot of tongue twisters Voy a decir uno bien cortito vaya. She sells shells by the seashore <laughs> And the other is Peter I learned that like Peter Piper picked up a couple of peppers. So pick up pickle peppers, Peter Piper picks. If Peter Piper picks up a couple pickle peppers, what is a pick up pickle peppers? Peter Piper picked. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I know. I don't understand nothing. <laughs> Peter Piper picked up a couple pickle peppers. Una oración, y esa solo está le dando vuelta. Claps, claps, please. And there's another one very easy that it says, How much wood would a witchak chuck if a witchak witch wood? I know. Cuando llegue como otro nivel, ya le vamos a poner tonto. ¿Cuántos años tiene de tener su. de dar clases? De dar clases y hablar inglés. Amazing. That's a very good question, Fernando. No, I, I don't have any problem saying, yo, yo lo digo. I'm very proud, actually. Es el único trabajo que he tenido en toda mi vida. What? So you can imagine. I never, I never worked in anything else. I started teaching when I was 20 in a kindergarten. Mi primer trabajo fue un kinder. I worked for five years in a kindergarten, and then I continued teaching in different institutions. But I continue working with kids, and right now my current job it's I work with teenagers. But I work from kindergarten to university. Trabajado en todos los niveles. But speaking English, uh, probably twenty years. I've been speaking English for twenty years. Twenty years. Con razón lo disfruta tanto. Ajá. Con razón veo que cuando nosotros nos trabajamos es como Continue, continue. Uh -huh. <laughs> no lo ha logrado aún, but you can get it. I know, it's okay. It's fine. Tiene ah, mucha paciencia. Yes. Vaya, veamos, ¿qué lugares ven acá? There is, there are. Uh -huh. There is 
a church. There is a church. There is a, a hospital. hospital. There is a hospital. There is a bar shop. There is a mall. There is a department store. There is a, a grocery store. A grocery store. Uh -huh. There is there's a school. There is a school. There is a school. Bar oh no, the telephone. A phone. Uh, a phone company. A phone company. Or a public phone. Like, I'm a big phone train. No, it's a fancy one, but it's beautiful song. I know. There what is, is a there? museum? There is a museum. This is very similar to Ting Marin. Uh, uh, there is a library. There is a library. There is a cafeteria. There is a cafeteria or a restaurant. There is a cine. There is a the cine. There is a there cine. cine. There is a cine. There is a cine. There is a cinema or there is a movie theater. Cualquiera de los dos es correcto. Uh -huh. oh, movie there store, is no. a toy store. There is a toy store or a movie theater. Theater, como teatro. And this one, what is it? There is a eh, cafeteria. cafeteria. There is a cafeteria or a café. We usually say a cafe. No, coffee is the drink, but the place <laughs> is a cafe. <laughs> a cafe or a coffee station. You can say a coffee station. Uh, mm -hmm. so it, a friendly. Uh -huh. What about the dogs? This is San Salvador. <laughs> mm. <laughs> there is a uh, three dogs. There are. There are. There are three dogs. There are two beers. There are many cars. There are many cars. There are six cars. Six cars. There are many trees. There are many trees. There are plants. Four, three. Four, three. ¿Quién sabe cómo se dice en nube en inglés? Cloud. No. Cloud. Ahí está fácil porque ahora dice, subámoslo a la nube. Por eso es de cloud. Uh -huh. iCloud. Uh -huh. The iCloud. Uh -huh. There are some clouds. Or it's cloudy. Five, three, miss. Uh -huh. Five, three. There are five trees. There are some flowers. There are some bushes some plants, right? There are some streets as well. Okay. Plants so, or flowers? Plants or flowers, because there are some plants that are decorative, but not necessarily they have flowers. Ya, yes. ya pasado ahí por, ahí por Centro Comercial, aquí en Tecla, Santa Rosa, mm -hmm. que ha visto un, un lugar que ahí está como bien decorado con toda esa planta. Beautiful. Esos lugares son muy bonitos, actually. I love them. Vaya, ahora vamos a ver. Van a describir qué hay en sus... en sus town. Ok, town no necesariamente tiene que ser un pueblo. Cuando usted dice, ay, que como Xochitoto, como Apaneca, no. Town es como el lugar donde ustedes viven. Ok. O por decir algo. El downtown es como el centro de la ciudad. Eso va a depender. Por ejemplo, some people live in big cities, like in New York, uh, Los Angeles, pero igual hay un downtown. Sí, entonces es como el pueblo o el área donde ustedes están. No necesariamente donde viven, pues puede ser donde trabajan. If you live in San Marcos, that is your town. If you live in Santa Tecla, that is your town, yes? So, usted puede decir, I live in Santa Tecla, but in the downtown, or um, in, the, wow. in the center of the city, or in the neighborhoods, in the suburbs, como las zonas un poco más lejas, alejadas de, del centro, de todo lo, el comercio y todo, como en, los, en las residenciales, podría ser, ¿verdad? Right? Esos son como los suburbs. Pero por lo general, la gente dice, oh, my town, ¿sí? El lugar donde yo habito. 
Ok, let's see. Tenemos este slide. Déjenme. ¿Cómo se dice pueblo vivo? <risa> en El Salvador eso es que vivo, o sea, estar vivo significa no estar muerto, literalmente en inglés. <risa> o sea, entonces no lo podemos traducir así. Yo creo que eh, todo el pueblo vivo lo deberían traducir más como historical towns or uh, touristic towns or picturesque towns, como lugares pintorescos. For... For speaking English, the, o sea, no existe un, como el. Algunas cosas en no sí se, una palabra. De, sí, no se puede traducir que, tan literalmente, ajá, porque no es la misma connotación. Sí, porque yo lo intenté traducir en, en Google Translate, pero nada, ni por cerca. All right. Bye. Vamos a hacer estas oraciones y terminamos, ¿ok? A park, singular or plural? Singular. Singular. Entonces, uso? There, there is. is. There is. is. Entonces, me quedaría. <coughs> there is. A park between the hospital and the church. There okay. are. Next. Uh -huh. There are between a park between the hospital and the church. There are number two. There are two red there cars. Are, the three. Yeah. There are two red cars. Uh -huh. There are two there red are. cars in the street. Three. There are. There are. There are. Uh -huh. Ya se quieren ir, are. verdad? <laughs> <laughs> there are four bus stops. <laughs> I see the urgency. Quickly, quickly. Uh -huh. there, is. There, there is. is. There is. There, there is, is a shopping, shopping center, center next to the There is. 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 There are There are five <laughs> birds on the hospital. Wow. <laughs> there are there, is, there are, <laughs> there are, there there are three. three clouds in the sky. Ooh, buena buena estrategia. Buena Good estrategia. Good strategy. Good strategy. <laughs> ah, pero tranquilo, calma. Ahora, calma, pueblo, que aquí estoy exactly, yo. Exactly. Vamos a pasar la tenis one more time. Wow, we are so punctual. Now I'm going to upside down from the bottom to the top. Sandra? ¿Qué dijo? Sandra. <laughs> Sandra, Sandra, Sandra. Al, al revés. She's, She's not left. here. <gasps> Sandra, por left. favor. Gone. Ya no fue. Bueno, solo recordar lo que le corresponde a Rodrigo participe de mí. Antes de que vaya ahí. Like, I am here, cabal, antes de que diga good night, see you tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> antes que se... Only 15. Uh -huh. Only 15 students. Imagine, wow. Rodrigo, Raúl, present, René, <laughs> Present. Manuel. Present. Daniel. Present. Isaac. Present. Hans. Present. <laughs> Fernando. Present. Edith. Present. Edgar. Present. Diana. Blanca. Present. Andrea. Present. And Marcela. Present. Nice. See you Good tomorrow. Job. Bye. Tomorrow Hello. is Friday. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Good night. All right, Mr. Rodrigo Enrique Hernandez. So now you tell me. Do you have any question about any topic? Uh, no, I have to. It's very interesting. Uh, uh, the class? Yes. 
Eh, hay... Bueno, que... I you remember, like... I remember the, the structure of the language. Eh, que se me habían olvidado. En vocabulary. En vocabulary. Exactly. Yeah. And you like to practice with your partners? Yes. Yes, I like to practice. Yes. Like to practice they are very interesting. They give I good like examples. To, I like to help, 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 help you. Yeah, you like to help your partners. I like to help my partners. Exactly. That's nice. Uh, That's good. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> yes, when there is a, a class and a group of people, they are good partners and they work in groups, they work as a team, they participate, they help each other, they get into a good community of students. The environment is good and the learning, it's very, very efficient and that's what yeah. we want. Exactly. Yes. And people are very nice and very kind too. That's another thing. Because um, working with nice people make you feel more comfortable and make you participate more. That's good. The, the, the first class is uh, very quiet. Yes. <laughs> very, very quiet. Yeah. Everybody was nervous. Yes, yes, after. Yeah. And, and now everybody's relaxed. The last, the last weeks is a uh, talk, talk, yeah, talk, everybody talk, 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 everybody talk, talk, talk. Exactly, talk. that's good. All right, what about the platform? Did you complete the exercises on the platform? Yes, the, but, but I use the app, the app, the app. Mm -hmm. Uh, the, um, uh, perdón, ¿cómo sería ayer? La página casi no la, la web, no la, casi no la he revisado. Oh, really? You need to complete sí. the exercises on the platform. Sí. The units uh, are complete. Mm -hmm. the, the exam. Uh, mm -hmm. I, that I, I tratar como sería. I try. I try to uh, day by day the exercise. Mm -hmm. To complete exercises every day. Exactly. Uh -huh, complete that the, is the idea. Uh -huh. Rodrigo, yes, you have a good progress. Let's think. Mm -hmm. Yes, you only need to complete. Uh, the homework for the unit four and the yes. final exam mm -hmm. but you can do that on this weekend okay para que el lunes ya esté free ya no tenga que depelar <laughs> on monday okay. uh -huh. so you can complete that tomorrow or saturday or sunday and then on monday you relax okay mm -hmm. yes. what about your daughters Tell me about uh, your daughters. They they sleep right now. They are sleeping. How old are they? Uh, she, they sleep uh, to night, night p.m. Yeah, they go to bed at nine. And how old are they? They uh, they three years old. Three. Three years old. <gasps> Yo pensé que estaban más grande. I thought they were six or, or seven. No, no, no. They are just three. Three years. In they January, are very smart. In January, where they? Where they in January? Their birthday is in January. Mm -hmm. Really? They are going to be four? Yes. Okay. Nice. And you only have those two daughters? Oh. Or you have more children? No. Only two daughters. Only two. That's it. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the end of the story. Yes. It's a lot of responsibility, right? 
<laughs> Too much work. I know, but they are so cute. Yes, it's so cute. And they go to school or they don't go to school? They don't go to school. Next year? Uh, no. Uh, when they get five? Yes. They are going to go to kindergarten? Yes. Nice. Interesting. For the, for the COVID? Because of the COVID. Mm -hmm. Yes, many parents are. My, my, the uh, wife. my wife, my wife and my uh, I guess not uh, not as a, a time book. Uh, he, uh, they go to the school. To take them to school, to go to pick them up, right? Yes, and you have to protect your children, definitely. Mm -hmm. yes. True. Well, very interesting family <laughs> with twins. <Thank> you. <laughs> I bet it's a big responsibility when they were babies, right? Yes. They cry at the same time. They were hungry at the same time. They want to sleep at the same time. Yes. And they are very similar. Yes. Really? Similar. And you have more twins in the family? Uh, my grandmother have a, a twin. A twin? Um, her, 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 her grandfather was a twin too. And you don't have a twin brother. No, no, no. Imagine. I, I have also, uh, one brother. Only one brother. Only one brother. Mm, and your wife doesn't have twins in her family. No, uh, her, her, her grandmother had a Twins. Oh, really? Yes. So you have twins in both families. That's why there was a big probability to have yes. a twin. Yes, because in my family, there are no twins, no cousins, no sisters, no brothers, no grandparents, twins, nobody. We don't have twins. We just have a lot of girls, a lot of women. My brother has four daughters and one son. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Imagine yes. that's a lot of girls, but in my in the in the family of my wife uh, has have a four four sisters. Four, four sisters. sisters. Oh my god! I only have three brothers. I don't have sisters. That's the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> How interesting. Well, anyways, it's been a pleasure talking to you. And I really like that you keep a conversation only in English. For level one, imagine. Continue practicing. When you get to other levels, you're going to be able to communicate only in English. That's really nice. Is, 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 the, is that the is a idea? That's the is idea, the, exactly. The idea. That's the plan, that's the objective. <laughs> yes. Nice. Thank you for staying. Good job. Okay. I see you Thank tomorrow. You. Take see care. Tomorrow, Bye. Bye.